What's going on YouTube? Snipes here with TKO Gaming. Here we have a video for you guys. The top five ways to improve in the Crucible. Maybe even become a Crucible Pro. But really, for you guys that are new to the Crucible, you guys are gods in PvE. But you're struggling in your PvP, aka Crucible game. Maybe in Trials of Osiris. Whatever it is, this video will help you out. Make sure to check it out. And if you like it, share it with your friends and like the video as well. So let's get straight into it. It's a short video, so I'm going to be speeding through this. You guys can rewatch the video, slow it down, whatever you need. And thank you so much once again for watching. So starting off, number one, your class selection is probably the most important. This is something I had to learn early on. Three classes so far in Destiny 1, Hunter, Titan, Warlock. Make sure you pick a class that suits you, all right? No how the classes work know the move the movement is probably the biggest thing on the classes the warlock movement sucks the hunter movement fantastic the titan movement is quite possibly the most difficult but also the most rewarding if you can get it down the titan is the fastest class in the game if you guys do not know that now make sure that you also with that follow the supers and the subclasses for each class all right Pick a subclass once you figure out the movement of the character. Pick a subclass that works for you. Now, I will say that the Warlock is probably the best hybrid to use both for PvP and PvE, in my opinion. So, if any of you guys are wondering what class you should master, I always recommend the Warlock. But honestly, the Hunter is always close to my heart. The step number two, or I say the number two way, would be that once you've decided your character, now set it up for success. Now I already said pick the right subclass, but then you have to go and make sure that if you need intellect, discipline, or strength, which one should you max out, right? Right now I believe that what you can do is you can max out two out of the three and then you can have two tiers on the last one. That's if your gear is absolutely perfect. So keep that in mind guys. We have videos in the past if you guys want to check it out where I show you guys exactly the best build. For example, if you want to run Void Warlock or if you want to run a Gunslinger Hunter or an Arc Hunter, what should your subclass setup be? Meaning, you know, what, what uh, tiers you should have, what settings you should have. It's very, very important. All right, so make sure you guys have it. There's uh, settings for PvP and there's settings for PvE. We pretty much show both. Now, third way I would say is understand the maps of destiny is specifically let's say if you're trying to beast on a map that you're in understand the map that you're playing learn all the maps now that there's custom games in destiny which is amazing aka private matches go into those private matches and check it out go run around see the map see the lane see the covers maybe get some friends that want to improve in the pvp world as well to understand the maps get them in there and learn with them all right it's very important if you're not sniping stay out of the popular sniping lanes you most likely will get sniped understand where your enemy is going to spawn right that's very important if you're on one part of the map if your team is heavily on one part of the map the team will most likely spawn as far away as possible so it's good to know you know where you should be looking next after you get your kills right it's a huge advantage okay reason number four reason number four is judgment this is so important guys this is something i have to still have to learn i'm a lot of players in destiny still have to learn this for example you're in a gunfight right you should know when you are not going to win that gunfight if you can evade that gunfight that is amazing if you are in a very very sticky situation with like two or three of your opponents around you or maybe even two or maybe even one in your week figuring out you know what your opponent is going to do and making the right choice to get the hell out of the damn fight so that way your teammates can come and save you or help you out or you're out of the fight you can reposition get a better angle you know have a better approach to defeating your teammates or not your teammates sorry your uh, opponents i'm always gonna have one slip up in these like live commentaries i promise you guys along with the judgment comes minimizing deaths you know that'll help you minimize your deaths your kd will be better you'll help your team out it's just all around greatness and the last reason guys is overall destiny is a very very team-based game you know from raids to strikes to crucible you don't have to be the you know the best individual player in the game rather you should be one of the most smartest players in the game 
which means you know you follow the steps on becoming a smarter player all the reasons i gave you are good starting points you know there's definitely more advanced things you can do you can outsmart your opponents and not be better than them when it comes to you know your gun skill it's very very cool what this game has and honestly at the end of the day practice 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 it's the most important thing you know, if you want to take it seriously, maybe even get an elite controller, or a scuff controller, it'll help you get better because your thumbs don't have to leave the joysticks ever. Um, make sure you guys follow these steps. Like the video if you know if you found it helpful because it'll help other people see as well. Share the video if you want, and please comment below. You know what your class is, what your favorite PvP class is, and maybe I'll make a video explaining how I set that class up. And thank you guys so much once again. Please check out the description below and come say what's up to us in the stream. If you come from the YouTube, we give you guys beat bucks. Yes, beat bucks get you raid runs, trials, everything. I'll see you in the next video, guys. Peace.